Brian, this is video number, wow, we're up to video number like 15 or 16, something like that. What we're going to do is we're going to add our website to the Google Webmaster Tools. And the reason we want to do that is it gives us all kinds of great information. It, it sends us warnings about WordPress updates. It gives us insight as to links to our website. It uh, provides information based on search queries. As you can see, I have a couple sites uh, already listed here. And if we come into Marketing Easy Street, we can see some um, information. This is pretty awesome, S search queries. Now this is basically how many impressions, how many times my, my site is appearing on Google. And then they also give some information on uh, clicks. We come into search traffic. We can come into search queries. And you can actually see here, we're getting about 3,500 queries a day. Um, and then they'll even give us kind of the keywords that we're showing up for. And again, just lots of uh, uh, information. I'm looking at internal links. This is links pointing to my site. You can see I've got some good links coming into the site. And that's exactly why we want to add our new site and why you should want to add your site as well. And the process is really pretty easy, especially if you're using the Yoast plugin, like I mentioned um, earlier in an earlier uh, videos. Now, all we need to do is uh, grab some information from Webmaster Tools, plop it right here and save changes. So how do we do that? We're going to click Add Site. And I'm going to copy this information here. So add site. Continue. Let's see if that format is OK. OK, we're going to click Verify. OK, that was almost too easy. Um, if we go back here, you might sometimes have to add, if you do that again, um, you might get a, a little bit of a meta snippet. Here we go. And you would just add that in. So we'll get some information soon. Um, let's also submit a sub uh, site map, right? So that would be pretty awesome. Submit a site map. All right, so you can see here, I'm going ahead and I'm going to add a uh, site map, the video site map. I'm going to um, submit the site map. Let's refresh the page. Okay, that's awesome. Let's go ahead and uh, submit another one. If we, if you remember, if we come into, uh, let's go to the dashboard, tracking, security. Uh, there we go, XML sitemap. Sitemap is here. So I'm going to go ahead and take a sitemap index. I'm going to add that as well. And that's just basically going to help the pages of my site get indexed. Um, this is really great for the video one. The other ones, Google's going to find out, out on its own. But with the video sitemap, remember, we're, going, we're actually submitting videos to be indexed. And that's what's really uh, quite helpful. Here's add sitemap. Okay, great. So you can see here we have one video sitemap. We have one regular web sitemap. All right, super. So we're going to refresh the page.
All right, awesome. So there you go. So you can use these sitemaps to really uh, get some better indexing to drive more traffic and uh, check it out. I think you'll see that it really can improve your rankings over time.